Hi guys, welcome to another tutorial on my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to take a video screenshot with Filmora 11. Okay, so it is very simple, just some step here. And if you don't have Filmora 11 yet, I will put the link in the description for you to download or to upgrade to this latest version. And if you want to purchase the software, don't forget to use my 20% discount coupon code in the description. Okay, so let's go to my computer screen. Alright, so now I'm inside Filmora 11 and first thing first, if you want to take a screenshot of uh, the screen or the preview window, you need to put the playhead at the position where you want to take a screenshot. So maybe it is the best frame in your video and then you can take a screenshot and get the image and edit it and make a thumbnail for your YouTube video or anything else. Okay, for example, I can put my playhead at this position. Okay, so I'm going to take a screenshot of this frame and the next thing you want to go back to your media because when you take a screenshot uh, with the preview window here uh, the screenshot will jump into the opening folder on your computer uh, on your software I'm sorry so be sure to open the media folder and then select folder and then when you take a screenshot uh, the image will be saved in here in this folder and then you want to find this button on the right side of the timeline it is a snapshot button so just click here to take a snapshot and then you have an image here okay now you can right click at the image and then you can add it to a new track on the timeline for example here i can have a image of this one and if you want to find it on your computer all you need to do is to right click at the image at the media folder and then select review in explorer okay and it will be in your in your computer uh, this is the location of the the snapshot folder okay so this is the image that we have just taken from Filmora and you see the image quality is very good okay so that is how to take a video screenshot with Filmora 11 I hope this tutorial is helpful for you if you have any more questions just let me know in the comment section below thank you very much for watching and I will see you in my next video goodbye